Good morning, everyone. It's Tammy, and it's time to do one of the 52 Christmas cards that I am going to try to do every week this year. And today's card was inspired by something I saw online, and it's going to be a little present, and I think it'll be fun. I went ahead and picked out just a gold backdrop. I think that that will be good. And today I'm also going to be using my Jane Davenport uh, fun inks. I don't know what they're called exactly, but um, they're fun and they are like watercolor already in. It's like uh, having one of my water color these, but they're already filled with ink. So I'm just going to pick out a few colors that I think I might like. And I think that color I just had would be kind of pretty. And then I'll do red and I'll do green, of course, because it is Christmas. Ding, ding. And maybe I'll use these colors. I don't know, let's start with the green. Let's do green on the bottom. And I'm just taking this and I'm just going to make a little line. Just like that. And then I'm taking another, this might be a little softer purple color. And it doesn't really matter what colors you use, whatever you like. And I might even pick one more. I think that four might not be good. I, I like usually odd numbers usually. Ooh, this one kind of got a little juicy there at the back. I might need to go over that purple again. And then red. I'm going to take, because that one was a little too juicy. Look at that, it like erased everything. How about that? Okay, let's try this again. I'm going to take this really juicy one. I'm going to wipe it off on my little napkin. Do it again. I'm going to use that purple again. Then I will do the red. And then I think I will do another color. Let's try. Blue. I'm going to take one of my little brushes and I'm going, I love this blue color, but it's so bright. I'm just going to take my white or my, my water <laughs> and just kind of loosen that up just a little bit. There we go, pick some of that color up. And I probably want this to dry a little bit, so while it's drying, I think I'll write Merry Christmas and This one.
So I'm just trying to use some of the techniques I've been learning. Not mastering any of them yet, but having fun trying. Goodness, I need a little more light. Well, that's better. And now I'm just bolding all of my downward strokes. Christmas. Doom, doom. And then this looks pretty dry. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make a little box. And then draw a little bow. I think that's pretty good. How cute is that? And then I even might take my clear sparkle. This blue seems to have some of it on here, which is probably from my paint pen before that I used, or my watercolor pen that I used. And I'm kind of getting all of these and all the colors, aren't I? But that's all right. And I am just going to make it sparkly, sparkly just because that's fun. Oh, it's so cute. Merry Christmas. I love this color. I don't know if it has a name. Byron Bay. It does. And it's my favorite of those for sure. At least today. <laughs> that can, that's subject to change, of course. I have just been enjoying making these simple cards, but I think they're fun and I know I'm going to have fun giving them out. And I'm hoping that it's just giving you some inspiration to share some card making this year, perhaps, or maybe if it's not card making, maybe it's something else. But I do think that people really seem to appreciate getting happy mail. And then what a better way than making it a homemade card and then they I don't know they get a little piece of you too and these are super simple and super fun and easy to do at least for me I mean if you guys are watching this you probably have a little bit of something in uh, we have something similar I'm getting my fingerprints all over this gold <laughs> Okay, that is the card for today. Super easy, my goodness, under 10 minutes. We have a beautiful card, and that's that. So thanks for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.